Well, hello and welcome to the Al Salam Stadium. We find ourselves in northern Cairo at a stadium that was built for the 2009 FIFA Under 20 World Cup, but has been used successfully so far in the 2019 Africa Cup of Nations of Egypt. Well, the round of 16 is uh, getting underway today. It's the first match in the first ever round of 16 at the Africa Cup of Nations. It features the uh, first of the North versus West Africa matches which uh, we will see three of in the last 16 stages as Morocco's Atlas Lions take on the squirrels of Benny from Ziyech and Nesri running through the centre Amrabat's coming in at the back post Ziyech with a low drive Amrabat still keeping it alive inside the area and Nesri is with him and waiting for it was uh, a man in the pocket Belhanda who strikes it awfully and pulls his effort well wide of the Benny goal Ball in here, Benin at the opener, quite brilliantly, a man with the jersey 13, some say unlucky, Wazadilu scores for Benin against the Moroccan side that had yet to concede in this tournament. It's the set piece that's done the damage and now Morocco are playing catch up, Bornu beaten, Morocco down. in here, great opportunity to score off the bench, Sufian Bouffal with an almost immediate impact, and the idea was good as well. The delivery, quality from Amrabat in towards an unmarked Buffal. And so difficult for goalkeepers when you bounce it in, it almost sounds very difficult for goalkeepers. The idea was superb, the execution less so. So Benny, they're not counting their chicken, so to speak. Great chance to level matters here, and his second goal in the tournament sees it level at 1-1. Yusuf and Nesri, after Morocco, one back possession, perhaps breaking Benin hearts. Have got an equalising goal. And after a relatively... Busufa goes, and brilliant from uh, Alagbe. Busufa so close to going good, it's out for the corner, and Alagbe... Be lovely work from Buffal. Finds Hakimi inside that 18 yard area. Down he goes. The referee says penalty. 45 seconds of added time remain, and Morocco have the penalty call in their favour. The mainstay within the Moroccan setup. Fires it into the woodwork in a way he still can't score. Benin remain alive and the chance to win it in the final seconds from 12 yards out it's opportunity to see morocco win it in 90. two extra time we go one one it is here at the old finals it is knockout football there must be a winner after 120 minutes these sides could not be separated and a penalty shootout will decide the team that advances one one after 120 minutes penalties to come Buffal misses and it's advantage Benin after two kicks. The on loan Southampton man fires over the crossbar. Amen Tijani. The youngster fires successfully into the back of the Moroccan net and they're showing real confidence from the penalty mark here, Benin. He's got two goals in his four matches at this Africa Cup of Nations. Yusuf in the city. The Leganes striker from the penalty mark. Up against Alagbe. Oh, makes the first save of the penalty shootout. And Benin are two to the good in this shootout. First the miss by Bufal, and now the save from Alagbe to deny Yusuf and Nesri. Saved it onto the woodwork and away. Sebu Mama. Mama. For Benin to take them into the quarterfinals and create history once more. Michel Lusuya previously took Guinea into the quarterfinals. He's now taken Benin. The Atlas Lions of Morocco are out of the Africa Cup of Nations. A perfect record in the group stages. But they could not beat Benin, who create further history here. Ziyech struck the woodwork from the penalty inside 90. Benin down to 10 players. But after all the hype, after all the flair, after all the success for the Moroccan players in their respective club seasons, they have been undone 
by the squirrels of Benin and the knockout stages of this competition. History created. Morocco won, Benin won, but Benin advanced 4-1 on penalties.